The United States is discussing deploying American military forces to Eastern Europe with its NATO allies, a senior administration official said as President Joe Biden weighed options for responding to Russia's threats to Ukraine. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin has placed 8,500 troops on high alert to assist the defense of NATO allies, Pentagon spokesman John Kirby told a news briefing. He said no deployment order was given. The decision has been made to place these units on higher alert and only on higher alert, Kirby said. No decisions have been made to deploy troops from the United States at this time. With Moscow amassing more than 100,000 troops on its neighboring border and no diplomatic breakthrough in sight, the West is stepping up its response amid growing fears that an invasion is imminent. Talks are ongoing with NATO countries that could accept U.S. military forces as part of a plan to deter Russian President Vladimir Putin's aggression, the official said. NATO said it was sending ships and fighter jets to Eastern Europe and that Washington has also made it clear that it is considering increasing its military presence in the eastern part of the alliance. Biden participated in a 90-minute video conference with Europe to discuss Russia's military buildup on the Ukrainian border. NATO Secretary General Jens Stoltenberg, British Prime Minister Boris Johnson, Polish President Andrzej Duda, French President Emmanuel Macron, German Chancellor Olaf Scholz, Italian Prime Minister Mario Draghi and other leaders participated in the call. In a statement, the White House said Biden and European leaders reaffirmed their concern about Russia's military buildup on Ukraine's borders and expressed their support for Ukraine's sovereignty and territorial integrity.